My name is Stephnora Okere. When I started um, acting professionally, that is in Hollywood, we just had this film industry that was evolving into something that we couldn't even tell where it was going. The actors were there, we were ready. A lot of us came from the university. A lot of us came from soap operas like Ripples and Checkmate. A lot came from stage performances from National Arts Theatre in Lagos. And we all just, come, you know, we come together and we go for auditions here and there. And we know, oh, this is an industry. At least we have a platform where we can display our art. We weren't even about the money. We weren't even about um oh now i can put food on my table that's not to say we didn't hope to make money but what i'm saying is when we started as actors we loved to do the work we enjoyed the art we enjoyed to see people watch our films and tell us oh i enjoyed you in this movie in that movie but um as time went on of course like every other industry we got infiltrations from people who knew nothing about the industry when it comes to acting and then you know what happens. This is Speaks TV. Oh, yeah. Producers grew over time. We have producers like Zeb Ejiro, Chico Ejiro, uh, the first person who did uh, a Nigerian film in English language that became popular, in, in, in Igbo language that became very popular, that's a uh, neck video links. He came up with the film. Uh, living in bondage there were other films in Igbo language then it went into English language there was uh, glamour girls we had producers like um, uh, Fred Amata the Amata family they came into the industry and they came in with their own kind of story the story of the cultural Nigerian person then there was also the upcoming producers who had stories who didn't know what to do with the story but look for sponsors and how to get money together to shoot films over the years producers have grown gradually and then came the big one the marketers they came into the industry put their money in the industry sponsored a lot of films they're still there doing films but now what we have is a playing ground for everybody there are producers here there are producers there you're either a marketer producer or independent producer there, there are producers who are members of producers guilds there are producers who are independent producers who, who just practice freelance so the industry has grown to the point where there is a room for everyone Right now, we're building a structure. We started building a structure from the beginning, but at this point, we still are building. So the Nollywood industry, from the point of view of an actor, I can say we've come of age. We have actors that the whole world can point to and say, oh, that's a good actor. We have people like Genevieve Inaji. We have myself. We have Omotola. We have Ramzi Noa. A whole lot of exports from Nigeria, from Africa, Bambika, um, and the rest of them. This is Speaks TV. Oh.